Hey guys, I'm here to do a Valentine's tag. Um, I saw the tag originally on, well, originally for me, on Moon Button's video. And she said that it came from Hush Little Babies video. So I checked out her channel and I'm not subbed to Hush Little Baby, but I am now. <laughs> and she has a Valentine tag and so fun. Um, she said in the video, not Moon Button, but Hush Little Baby said that she was watching someone's box opening and in the box opening there was like, um, a t-shirt that said something about daddy's little girl or something. And I, I have no idea who she's talking about because I don't watch a lot. I haven't been around on YouTube lately, so... Um, but she said that she kind of giggled because in the video, the lady who did the box opening said that the daddy has no idea about the doll. So, um, it inspired her to do a tech video about your partner on Valentine's. So, um, Moon Button has, um, typed out all of the questions. So that's why I'm looking over at my laptop and she has... 10 questions and i'm here with Anna amelia she is my original first uh partial silicone um still in her original body because when i received her i didn't know how to reweight babies or anything like that i do now but now that i do i think i might just keep her as is i don't know she has her original body on her and it's signed by Michelle Fagans, her sculptor. This is the ocean sculpt. Oh, I have shown it in the previous video, but I really want to get to these questions. They sound really fun. So I'm here with Anna Amelia, and let's get started. Number one, does your partner know about the reborn babies? Um, I've been in this hobby since 2015, so he does know about the dolls. Um, in fact, I was with him when I discovered the hobby. So um, I, I fell upon this hobby by accident. I had no idea about Reborns. I wasn't even into collecting dolls at all. I mean, I loved dolls as a little girl, but... Um, the last doll I had was my Cabbage Patch, and I received her when I was a child, a young teen, and I still ha I still have her. She was the only doll that I've hung on to all these years, and um, I didn't even think about the hobby, didn't even think about dolls, um, but I came across a Reborn video by accident, and I'm like, what? That's a doll? And yeah, it's no bald from that. But I was with him when when I discovered the dolls, and um, I don't like her. I'm just looking. Her diapers got me distracted. But yes, he does know about the dolls. Oh, she's so sweet. See if she, you can see her. Oh, you can see her a bit better. Let's see. Number two, do you ask your partner's opinion about or approval for having a new reborn baby? Um, no, because um, I use my own money. I don't use um, a fund that we both, like, you know, it's not affecting our bills. It's not affecting anything. It's just, oh, her feet are just looking at, look how real she looks. She's so distracting. You're distracting me, baby. She's asleep. My hands look so dry. Um, so, no. Because I use my own money. Now, if there was something... No, that never happened. <laughs> uh, number three. Does your partner want to be there with you when you do a box opening of your new reborn baby? Um, it's not that he might want to be, but I don't want him to. No, he probably, he doesn't care about it. And I feel kind of shy filming around him anyway when I do a box opening. So I just prefer to be alone anyway. Um, 
let's see number four does your partner ever get upset when yet another reborn baby arrives in case you haven't discussed this first no no uh no um i remember in the beginning like you guys my collection is huge and maybe in the beginning when i had like um, I don't know, 15 dolls. That's when he was like, oh, another one again, another one again. But but now, now the collection is so big, he, he just doesn't notice. So, and you know what? He collects uh, crossbows, and I had no idea how many he had in his collection. <laughs> um, let's see, number five. Does your partner want to hold your Reaper babies? Um not not by himself but i think i've asked him to hold a couple like just to feel how their weight and doesn't this feel real and um he actually did hold Zena one time when she was all dressed up in his favorite uh like he has a favorite football team and i bought a whole bunch of football things for her to wear and that was when he he had a picture with her so i thought that was pretty cool He's the one that wanted to take a picture. So that was cool. Um, number six. How does your partner feel about you taking your reborn babies out? Does he want to join you? Um, I haven't taken my babies out. I've taken them out like on the land that we own and he doesn't mind. And, um, I've taken them out a few times, like, well, once to the doctor's office, but. I, he, I was by myself. He wasn't with me, so. Oh, well, she's getting heavy. She's getting heavy. <laughs> um. Let's see. Number seven. Does your partner ever berate you about buying too many baby clothes? No. <laughs> Number eight. Does your partner help you out in any way, for instance, by assembling baby furniture? That never happened. Um, I assemble. I assemble my own stuff. No, that never happened. <laughs> um, does your partner ever surprise you with a little present he brought for your reborn baby? See, I actually did pick out a few things. I bought them. But, I mean, he actually, he would say stuff like, you should buy this. You should buy this. And he actually picked out a couple of dolls as well that I bought from, from his suggestion. So, yeah. Um, in a way, he'll just kind of suggest that I buy them. Um, number 10, does your partner like to watch YouTube videos with you about reborn babies? <laughs> it's, it's not that he purposely watches them, but he, I will watch videos when he's in the room and he'll listen to them and he'll make little comments. Like for instance, um, a video I was watching today on YouTube, he says, uh, like it sounded like Stephanie. And he said, are you watching Stephanie? He's like, no, this is somebody else. He's like, oh, it sounds like her. <laughs> and then one time I was watching somebody else a while ago. And he's like, oh, are you watching so-and-so again? And I'm like, no, no, this is somebody else. And he'll say, oh, it sounds like her. <laughs> Stuff like that. So he doesn't watch them. Maybe he might glance up at the TV and see them if I'm watching them on the TV. But normally... Normally we have our own, like, we're doing our own thing, so. I don't mind watching them around him at all. So, anyways, and that was the 10 questions. So this is fun, and my arm is killing me. Uh, she's so, oh, be careful. Be careful with me, someone. Oh, she's so sweet. And Amelia, can you see her? Okay, just a second. She is a big, big girl.
see her head. <laughs> her head is oh, oh, but she smells like baby. See, look, there's Avery. Aren't they cute on her? I think Erin gave me these from I think Candy Little Sparkle. This this elastic is it's a sleeper bag, but. So it shouldn't be really helpful. So that's what it looks like. Oh, and it comes with a hat. So anyways, guys, hope that you're having a great day. Sorry if I'm too close to the camera. <laughs> but I hope that you're having a good day. And thank you so much for being here. And this is a lot of fun to do this day. Enjoy your day, guys. Thank you for coming here. Bye, guys. Bye,